Connecticut family is urging their neighborhood to be on alert after their dog was attacked in their own backyard. They think the dog's attacker was a coyote. Consumer reporter Linda Becquero live in Greenwich with the family's warning. Linda? After losing her four-year-old toy poodle, a Greenwich homeowner is hoping that her pain tonight will serve as a warning for other pet owners. <laughs> Harley, a toy poodle, joined the Gazinski family shortly after they moved to a new home in Greenwich, not far from Westchester County Airport. It's good. <laughs> she was so happy, though, so jumping on everyone you know, like petties, you know, and everything. But last Thursday night, the routine of letting Harley out for a few minutes before bedtime took a frightening turn. This particular night, um, she didn't come back, like usually after two minutes, she come back quickly. I was like... Orna showed me the spot where Harley usually goes, but that night, she found the nine pound dog had been bitten to death, she believes by a coyote. I want to look at her less time to say goodbye and sorry. Were not affecting her, and 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 I start crying again. On its website, Greenwich Police warned that coyotes thrive in Lower Fairfield County. Stamford PD also issued a warning recently. Coyotes can see larger dogs as competition and small dogs as prey. They say small pets should be supervised when outside, and if you see a coyote, be aggressive by making loud noises, waving your arms, or spraying with a garden hose. Yeah. Orna says she hopes sharing her experience will help protect other pets. I learned a lot about, um, I informed all of my neighbors. Well, coyotes are usually most aggressive in the spring and early summer as they tend to their young. But again, they are known to be throughout parts of Greenwich and Stamford, especially in the heavily wooded areas around here. So police are warning you to keep an eye on your pet, even if it's in your own backyard. Reporting live in Greenwich, I'm Linda Becaro, News 4, New York. Back oh, to you. Okay, good advice. Thank you, Linda.